What's up, what's up, YouTube? This your girl's the hard guy, Lil E, in the building. Um, here with a little video. And I'm gonna uh, just talk about the bull breeze. Um, you know, why the bull breeze get so much hate and so much stuff going on with the um, bull breeze. And, and including the bull breeds are the American Pitbull Terriers, the American Bullies, the English Bulldogs, American Bulldogs, Bull Terriers, Staffordshire Terrier, Staffordshire Bull Terrier, you know, so on and so on. Is it that because the media gives them a bad name? Or is it because irresponsible owners? I say both. You know, I say both. And the reason I say both is because... Excuse me. The reason why I say both um, is because... I'm going to start with the media. The media puts out this negative image about pit bulls and bullies or pit, pit dogs, whatever they call them. Give them a bad name, a bad rep. And that's how we get all these legislations and laws and stuff against... Uh, our beloved bull breeds, you know. Every time a child gets attacked, oh, it's a pit bull, a pit bull. And if, and if, if they ain't killed the dog, they'll show the picture of a dog. Most of the time, it's either an American bully or a pit bull mix, some, some type of mix. And most of the dogs that are in the pound are bullies or bully or pit bull mixes, put it like that, bullies. You can tell an American bully, and then you can tell the uh, pit bull mix, pit bull, bully mix, whatever, mix, or whatever, so. And most of the time, and I know there's other breeds of dogs that's way worse than pit bulls and bullies, the bad breeds, you know, that'll bite twice before a bully dog would. I'm saying a bull breed would, I put like that, a bull breed would. And, and you know the irresponsible owners. If you know you have a bull breed, depending on what line, bloodlines you have, if you know they are aggressive, you know, real animal aggressive, you gotta do your part to keep them contained in the yard. On the <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. Or on a chain setup, you know. And they gotta be secure. Because you know what's gonna happen. If they get loose, they gon' they see something, they gonna latch on to it. So, you know, a lot of times we have to do our parts to help promote our beloved breed, and we have to do our part to keep them contained, especially if they hot, they're ready to, and they're ready to go. You gotta keep them contained, you know. And you know, I love the bull breeds. I can get into other I can get into other breeds if I want. Matter of fact, if I wanted to get into a German Shepherds, I know someone that breeds German Shepherds that I can get German Shepherds from and start breeding German Shepherds, but I won't do that. Because I love the American Bully breed. I fell in love with the American Bully, American Pitbull Terrors, Bull Breeze and all. Any type of bull breed I fell in love with and that's what I'm gonna stick with. But I have to do my part. Everybody have to do their part to make sure the breed's legacy stay alive and keep them contained. And you know what the media and, and all these other activist groups will really learn what they have. That everything is not a pit bull. You know, everything is not a pit bull. You know, and another thing, another, you know, show... I said a show, uh, I don't know if y'all seen uh, Pitbulls and Parolees. Pitbulls and Parolees. I used to love that show. I almost, I tried to uh, adopt a puppy from them one time. But over the years, you know, I came to realize they part of the reason why the bully breed got a bad rep, got a bad name. Not because of the work they don't, you know, I'm happy that they, you know, rescue and all that. But most of the dogs they have are not pit bulls, they're bullies or pit mixes. And they putting out wrong information 
uh, brief specifics about that that's not true. Most of their dogs is not bullies, pit bulls, or not pit bulls, they mix, or straight bullies that they either know that they're American bullies and ain't saying nothing because they want to get more adoptions and donations and they know the truth or they just really don't know the truth. So because of that, I, I stopped watching pit bulls and pearlies because they not doing a breed no justice. And same thing with any other actors, group, shows, whatever. You know, they have the right information and and know about the breed, did they research. I feel things would be better. And, you know, if anything, they should put uh, legis legislations on uh, what's these little small dogs and teacup dogs. Why well, would put laws and registrations on them dogs because nobody want no little small well i say some do but not me i don't want no little small dog that could fit in my purse i need a dog big dog that i can walk that's going to protect that's going to be intimidated looking and that's going to protect along with that intimidated look and protect me you know so but that's just i say a little rant i mean it ain't no rant but it's just something i've been thinking about so let me go ahead and make a video, get it off my chest. I love y'all. Stay safe. Don't forget to like, favorite, subscribe. And, uh, you know, uh, like my video, comment, and I approve this message. I love y'all. Peace.